you're all very welcome. Uh, my name is Dave O'Mahony. I'm Head of Cinema Programming here at the IFI. And as I say, you're all very welcome to this evening's screening of Loving Vincent. And uh, we're delighted to have a little added bonus this evening. It wasn't in our printed programme. We have one of the artists uh, who worked on the film, one of the 125 international artists, legion of artists, um, um, who worked on the film, uh, Sandra Hickey, Irish-based, who is here to give a little introduction to the film and set the scene and give a little bit of context about it before you watch it. So if you could join me in welcoming Sandra Hickey. Thank you. Hello, how are you? Um, I'm so happy to see so many faces here to see Loving Vincent. Um, it was a real labour of love for all the artists, everyone that worked on the animation. Um, you will see 65,000 paintings uh, in front of your eyes tonight and it'll be 12 paintings per second so it took most artists about a week to get one second of footage so that just kind of puts it into context as to how uh, how labor in, in intense it was um, I um, came about this um, on top of this project and um, just by chance um, my brother sent me a link on Facebook, would you believe, uh, and they were recruiting for skilled oil painters, which is what I am. So, um, the power of social media. Uh, so, um, it started off as a Kickstarter, uh, and it was six years in the making, so it's, um, it's really a labour of love for everyone involved. We really um, believed in the project and its uh, ambition, its... its uh, it's a um, uniqueness and it's never been done before. It's the first in cinematic hi history to be ever be fully hand painted. So you see every brushstroke really massive on the screen. So that was something that we really had to um, get our heads around as painters. And also there was an interesting thing to get used to as a painter was um, each work you made, you were working on it for like two hours, maybe longer if it was a more intense scene. Um, but you had to scrape it off as soon as you finished that perfection and move on to the next one once it was recorded. So that was something very challenging for an artist to do. Um, so and a very good um, skill to, to, to create for yourself because uh, as artists we tend to be a little bit precious about our work. Um, and uh, there's never a final piece. So um, that was something very interesting. And there was 125 artists as... Uh, David has said so um, to be in a, in a working space with so many artists was phenomenal and they were all from different backgrounds different parts of the world and to learn their different practices how they came into art their different techniques was phenomenal so um, it's really a, a really dear project to all of us we really we still keep in contact with all the artists so it's um, it's a bond that we hope will never uh, <laughs> be broken um, also, we were, we were all big fans of Vincent van Gogh as well, so that's why this project was even more special to us, uh, to replicate him in the most justice and uh, respectful way that we could, and to present his paintings and come, have them come to life was something phenomenal that we could, were so privileged to be able to do. So um, I hope you enjoy and see all the labour of love that we have um, put, put on the screen. Uh, we also paid particular attention to um, facial expressions and uh, um, the eyes of each actor had to be really pop and had to really sparkle. So you'll see that come alive on the screen. And uh, it, was, it was painted from actual footage. So the actors um, acted in front of a green screen and we got the footage and a reference painting of Vincent van Gogh and then a few key frames um, from similar palettes of Vincent van Gogh and obviously the frame of the artist that came before you came before your scene, so to keep the consistency of uh, of the animation. So there were so many elements involved, uh, as well as trying to capture Vincent van Gogh's pure genius. So I hope you enjoyed tonight. If you have any questions, don't 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 hesitate to ask me at the end if you ever want to find anything out. Um, I'd be happy to answer any questions. So I hope you enjoyed the film. And thank you.